Hey, it's Robert with Clean Pool and Spa, and in this video, we're going to go over some expensive products your pool just doesn't need. And the first one on the list is pH Up. Now, this is obviously to raise your pH, but it can get expensive. You can use borax or Arm & Hammer washing soda for a fraction of the price, and it'll do the job just fine. And the next one on our list is TA, or Alkalinity Up. There are many expensive products out there, but you can go to your grocery store and get some generic baking soda to increase your alkalinity at half the cost. And this one is one of my favorites to avoid, and it's called a non-chlorine shock. Chlorine should sanitize, oxidize, and kill the organic matter in the pool, but these non-chlorine shocks only oxidize, they don't sanitize the water. So what you're doing is you're paying twice as much for a product that only does half the job. And as we can see from the SDS sheet right here, it says potassium peroxy monosulfate, and the trade name is potassium monoprosulfate. This does nothing more than regular grocery store bleach, and it costs twice as much. Now the next group of products I'm gonna lump all together and completely avoid. The first one is a mineral system like this cute little frog. They add minerals and metals to the water, and that's something that your pool doesn't need. And next are enzymes with a water clarifier and defoamer. Now I'm not saying that you should never use these products, it just makes much more sense to get a good test kit like the Taylor K2006 kit and keep your pool water balanced. So there you go, those are expensive products that your pool doesn't need. I'm Robert with Clean Pool and Spa. Check out the description box below, link to my website, cleanpoolandspa.com. Lots of great information over there. Like, subscribe, and comment here. As always, be safe and happy swimming. Bye.